total bullshit, but people can have their opinions. They're allowed to their opinions and it's noise. And the only thing that we can do is a group that is very close from top to bottom in our organization, from Chris down to every single player, to our academy coaches, to every single player. As we understand it's us against whoever wants to talk shit about us, that's no problem, no problem. We understand where we're at and we understand where we're going. And we also understand the context of the situation. And you can't take context out of a story and just write a story, because that in itself is bullshit, right? The context of the situation is, we finished the season last year with our heads held high in the stadium against LAFC. It took them till the final play, basically, of the game to get rid of us in a game that we controlled in many ways. Uh, and they went on to win a championship. Congratulations to them. We should, and those should say, they had a really good team and they won a championship. For us, we're moving in the right direction. Two years ago when I got here, we went through the first season, changing 16, 17 players, complete overhaul of our roster. And it went down to the final two or three minutes of the season, of which we were seconds. in the playoffs for the entire season until the last 30 seconds in which I think VAR apologizes, <laughs> yeah. Pro apologizes for a missed call in Kansas City that could have also got us in. Now, in the context of that, there are a lot of plays over the course of the season that we could have made to make that a, to get that one point and make that difference up. But we weren't, we weren't there. But let's say VAR makes that call. We're into the playoffs that year, okay? And then we take another step forward in the second year to get there. The only difference between where we were last year and where we are now is three months, four months, and six games. That doesn't change the direction and trajectory of an organization. In the context of those months and games, our captain, both two DPs have been injured. Our captain that had scored 18 goals has been injured. Our goalkeeper gets injured. We have had to adjust a few players for various reasons, some being family reasons and others. So we have players who are still coming in. Okay, we're managing a million dollar fine and no summer window, okay, which none of us asked for in the grand scheme of things. But we're managing a lot of different things in this finite amount of time and we're trying to fit that into this portion. We go off and we start the season. We haven't been played outplayed in every single game we play. We've played four on the road and two at home, right? Four on the road and two at home. Not many teams build momentum in MLS with four road games and two at home. It's difficult to build some momentum in that scenario, right? So outside of that as well, right? Again, getting people in, trying to go. We haven't had one break really in our, in our favor. Not that we're asking for anything that we don't deserve. I don't believe in that. I'll tell you when the other team should have had something. I'll tell you when we should. I'm very, very honest about where we are and what we deserve and don't deserve. We haven't had one break in our favor. And that goes into that could have been two points at home when a day on gets called for a goal that we score that is kind of a phantom handball whether it's a handball or not and for me the referee but whatever I don't need to go through all that again we haven't had one break we are where we are six games in the season that's part of it there's been other teams in MLS who've had just as bad of a start and gone on and won a championship in our league it's just how our, our league works right and so for us the most important thing is quote, Get rid of the noise. Don't care what anybody thinks. Don't care what anybody says. Don't honestly care who shows up in the stadium. We love our fans and we want them to be there and we want them to support us. But for us, what matters is we have to deliver on the field. We have to concentrate on the field in terms of what we're doing, our performances, our execution and getting wins. That's what we need to focus on every single day and every single time we come out or work together as a group. We have incredible belief inside of our group we have incredible belief in the direction that we're going. You can ask any of them. You can ask any of us. It's just about momentum. It's about time. It's about execution. It's about getting our group whole. And it's about moving forward and not allowing anything else to disrupt that process from taking place.